there she goes. And I want you to overbend her. Bring her head around towards your knee. Yeah, bend a little bit. There you go. Go ahead and get her a little rounder. And then soften. And I want her neck to drape a little lower. So round, bending, and soften, give. Bend a little bit there, and then soften. Because again, she's starting to come round, but you see how she still wants to uh, balance on that inside shoulder. So take her into a 10 meter circle. Right again, you got it. Bend her again. Good correction with that inside leg. She's moving nicely away from that inside leg. Uh, and get her a little rounder again. Work her down. And then so round her again. And round her again. And soften feet around. Take your time. That's it. And feet a little more rain. And yeah, round her again. And feet a little, yeah. You want to find that release in the minute she releases, let her stretch down a little lower. That's it. And soft, feet her a little rain. Because again, you were saying that she gets um, tight in the back. And so, again, we just gotta get her to drape her neck lower, that's it, and longer. So we get her, that's it, push. And when she puts her neck down like this, uh, it's, again, there's such a mind-body connection, it's a really submissive posture for her. It's like if a dog comes up to you with 